Hey, check out all the Dark Quartz I have. Look at that. Look at that. As soon as they give the witch some new skills for me to buy out, you can best believe I'll be rolling in that quartz. Oh, what's that? It costs 100,000 quartz for the new things. Nah, I got that. I got you covered. I got you covered right now. So starting off with Shield Boy, Sword Boy, and... <laughs> Two Ring of Winds? Two Ring of Winds? That's like 700 gold. I do be swinging fast though. Actually, you know, I wasn't sure what this run was going to be, but now I know what this run's going to be. This is going to be the keep the rings of wind for as long as possible and stack up as much attack speed as I can. That's what this run is. I am moving and swinging quickly. Werewolf with Predator? Yes. Yes. Anything to get rid of Sword Boy. Now the first shop has some okay items, but I don't want to sell anything that I already have. So let's move straight on through and go to the first adventurer fight. Sorceress lady. I hate this fight. There we go. She can be so obnoxious to fight against if you have um, skulls that aren't very good at dealing with aerial opponents. Ooh, I might take... No, I won't take Wraith. Come on, you gotta give me a better skull. Minotaur with Pulverize. Yeah, okay. Wait, is this gonna be another big Power Boy run? Come on. I've done enough big Power Boy runs. I've done enough Power Boy runs to last me a lifetime. Next shop we have... Is that Mage Necklace? It's Mage's Necklace! Oh my god! A treat like this, this early in the game. Mage's Necklace, let's get it. Oh, that's it, we're done. That's it, game over. Game over. Let's take the item shop, game over. Now all I need is Predator. If I can get Predator at this stage, this run is... is... Uh, done. Oh, Giant's Axe, that's pretty good. We've got double powder skulls. That's really good, actually. Oh my god. I'm one-shotting enemies with my giant axe swapping. So here we are at Yggdrasil. How are you guys doing? Are you having a good day or evening, depending on where you're messaging from? I hope so. And dodge the fist, do that, do that, bam, smack him a little bit. Give him something to think about. And there we go, look at that, he's gone. It's just as simple as that. Item is... little jack-in-the-box. Yeah, that's not too bad. But I'm definitely selling it as soon as I need to pick up something better. Okay, let's run in here and throw out some big damage. Let's just, uh, yep, yep, wrecking them, wrecking them, yep, yep, they're dead, they're all destroyed. Done. Simple. Go up here to Speed Boy. Oh, look at that, Speed Boy. No. Pulverize. Oh, let's just swap in. Oh, Wallop. Yep. Cool. Look at that. Mage's Necklace. Gonna take out that gold up there. Thank you, Mage's Necklace. Oh, look at that. The swap in. Instantly killed them both. Lovely. Get the item. It's the Gold Incense Burner. What a fantastic item to pick up at this stage in the game. Moving into the shop, we have trash items. Nothing I want here. Killabon, movement speed plus 30%. You know, we do have double ring of wind though. I'll take Killabon. We're now moving really quickly. Dude. Dude. I have never been this mobile. Skull is. Berserker. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Who do I replace? Who do I replace? Warrior or Minotaur? Warrior or Minotaur? I'm actually going to replace Warrior. Because Warrior already kind of had like a big good run for him. Oh, this is disgusting. Oh, this is disgusting. Oh, 
moving on to the second adventurer fight. Hi there, cutie. I'm gonna hit you first. Whoa, dude went flying way up into the air right there. Oh! <laughs> oh, that damage! He was ended. Oh, the insignia? Yeah, let's get rid of the Jack in the Box. I mentioned this earlier. I told you I was going to sell Jack in the Box soon. I am determined to keep both of those rings of wind, though. Which is... Hilarious. Damn, Berserker, you hit so hard. With that big boy damage. Ritual Staff. Ooh, I don't actually need Ritual Staff. I think that's the first time I've ever just instantly sold Ritual Staff. Feels weird. <laughs> oh, oh, they're flying. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, we just barrel through you here. There we go. Ah, oh, this is so badass. Oh my god. Oh my god, why is this damage so juicy thick? In the item shop we have Wraith, which actually isn't going to do that much for us considering we're doing all physical. Emergency Bomb helps boost physical though. Let's get rid of Hate Stone and pick up Emergency Bomb. Yes, it is as weird as it sounds. All right, Berserker. I don't think anyone ever could expect you to do this jump, but I believe in you, okay? <laughs> let's just not talk about that gaff, okay? Let's just not even... Ooh! They're making this hard for me. They're making this really difficult. Um... 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 I'll get rid of the armor, you know? I'll get rid of the armor. I don't need it. I don't need it. What do you think I am? I don't need armor. So now we've got this fun combination of having the Raven Feather that pulls enemies in and the Giant Axe, which knocks them away on swap. So it looks kind of funny. Ooh, and it just looks painful too. Oh. Oh, dude. Increased crit damage by 50%. Oh. They're giving me all these good items and I have to start making really tough calls. I'll get rid of the insignia. I mean, Mage's necklace is still good, right? Moving on to second boss fight. The Liana sisters. I actually don't think I've ever said their name out loud. Is it Liana? Yeah, it looks like it is. Yeah, this is going exactly as I expected it would. Oh, that was pretty slick. Oh my god. Let's uh, kill a barn in and avoid the first attack. Look at that. Didn't really do much for me though. Uh, I'm gonna play this actual safe and like avoid these attacks. you with that. Oh, she's gonna do her her big ooh, attack. Oh, and she's not even going to get it done. Oh! She didn't even get it done. Beasted. Oh, bone hourglass. Bone hourglass is pretty good. 
okay, I know I keep going on about how good Mage's Necklace is, but you've got to believe me. That's a good decision. Sounding uncertain. It's about making this run fun anyway. At this stage in the game, it's as good as done. We've, we've more or less guaranteed that this run is a success. So you know what? I'm just going to have some fun with the rest of it. Yeah, that's my excuse. No, don't do it! <laughs> in ye old shoppy, we have nothing all that good, to be honest. And face bug? Ew, the shop has been a disappointment this run. I guess I'll save my money and go somewhere else. Hello, big boys. Damn, this damage is ridiculous. Maybe this is the run where I end up keeping Minotaur until the end. Unless I get a better power skull. Which, that's not a better power skull. <laughs> then, um, yeah, I might end up keeping this guy for a long time. That'd be crazy. I'm not really a Minotaur fan. Why did that sound like I was talking about a sports team? I'm not really a Minotaur kind of fan. For anyone, any of you out there who aren't aware, this little flag up here marks a spot where you can jump in and then up and look at that. The gold is here. Drop down. There we go. I include those little things sometimes because I'm aware that like some people maybe haven't found all of these yet or know how to get them. And I want someone missing out on all that free gold. Look at that chain reaction of explosions. Skull is Jin with Fairy Tackle. That's actually one of the best Jins there are, but you know what's actually happening right now? I'm really enjoying Minotaur, so I'm not gonna do it. And instead I'm gonna move on. I'll replace Minotaur if I find uh, like, a, like a unique or a legendary power skull that's actually worth my time. I was hoping I'd break her there. Oh, broke him too. Oh, and him too. Oh. Oh, look at- Oh! Execution axe? Double axe? Is that legal? Let's get rid of the gold incense burner. I don't need money at this point. I've got too much money. This run's pretty crazy good. Yeah, this run's looking really good. Ancient incense burner. My god. Do I get rid of anything though? I mean, I could get rid of Bone Hourglass, but Bone Hourglass is synergizing with Raven Monarch. Really juicy right now. I said I was keeping these Rings of Wind, and I'm keeping them. So, you know what? I'm going to sell this incense burner something I would never normally do. Still keeping an eye out for the better skulls, just in case, you know, just in case. Ooh, here we go, unique skull. Um, Predator, give me Predator. Oh! Oh! No! This is a physical build, I haven't even come close to building for magic. No! It's my curse. It's my curse at this point. I swear it's my curse. I actually would like this bow. Can I get this bow? Yeah, let's just get rid of bone hourglass. 10% crit's pretty good. Damn. Okay, just the swap in alone is doing so much damage. Maybe getting rid of bone hourglass wasn't the right move. Okay, the damage of the swap is is a little bit screwy, okay? That's all. The swap in alone is doing more damage than my berserker. Look at this. Look at this. Ah. Oh. Samurai? Yeah, no, not samurai. Wow, going into the final boss with Minotaur? I think this is a first. I don't think I've ever gone into the final boss using Minotaur. This has been a really weird run. But 
strangely enjoyable. Yeah, let's get it. Big stupid chimera. Yeah. Jump and avoid that. Like we always do. Ah, I was too slow. Be paying more attention to where his footsies are like that. And jump and avoid that. I don't think you really have to do that all the time. But it's good practice for me. And do the... Oh, I should have dodged. Ah, I mistimed it. Really badly. I did mistime that one though, but I mistimed the first dodge. It's okay though. Look how much health we've got. Oh, pop them. Like the zits that they are. And dodge them. Swap into Berserker and walk away. Avoid the ping pong ball. And there you have it. Let's give the win to Minotaur. It was a really good run with really good items. And I normally wouldn't use Minotaur. So let's give him the decapitation. Ouch. Hell yeah, super solid run. Super solid. A Minotaur run with the help of Berserker? To be honest, I'm actually really proud of myself for keeping both Ring of Winds until the very end, and you should be proud of me too, okay? I'm just saying, you should be. If you haven't seen it already, I strongly recommend checking out my last video uploaded, the speed run, 16 minutes and 44. You won't regret it, it was a hell of a run. And it really helps to show off how absolutely broken some of the combinations in this game can be. Also, has anyone ever noticed that the wood above the fox's head kinda looks like Cloud's Buster Sword? But anyway, with all of that said and done, I'm out of here. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one.